Welcome! I am going to use potassium permanganate to oxidize stuff. We have powdered sugar, isopropanol, sulfur and red phosphorus. Let us begin. First, I put some potassium permanganate on this aluminium piece. Then, I am going to add some sugar on top of it. And then, more sugar. After that, I will mix them very well together so that there is lots of contact area between the two substances. And then I am going to ignite it. It takes a while. Next up, isopropanol. I am going to put few drops of it on top of potassium permanganate crystals. And then I am going to light it. As we can see, there is not much reaction between the two. That is most likely because the liquid must vaporize before it can burn. And thus its temperature stays fairly cold and that is not enough to break the oxygen of the potassium permanganate and accelerate the burning. Of course, we can see some potassium ions getting into the flame and coloring it blue. Next up, sulfur. I'm going to once again add some sulfur on top of potassium permanganate crystals. And then, after mixing it thoroughly, I am going to light it up. Then the final experiment, red phosphorus. This is a bit scary chemical, so I'm not mixing it that well. Then lighting it up. It was a lot more energetic than any of the previous tries. It was burning so hot that it actually burned a hole through the aluminium. As you can see, there is a hole in the middle of it. Last but not least, a big amount of sugar and potassium permanganate. Thank you for your time. If you feel like it, you could subscribe to this channel. I will be releasing more videos soon. See you next time. Bye.